Hi guys, welcome to the internal walkthrough now of our latest Coastline 228. As I mentioned before, this is the largest family van in the range and it also has three zones inside, uh, which I will take you through in a sec. So what you're looking at now is its side club lounge in the main living area. Uh, plenty of storage space, both drawers underneath the lounge and the overhead cupboards above. Panning around now to the kitchen. Lots of storage there above the kitchen. Lots of, uh, of uh, nice big wide drawers, cupboard under the sink and a full oven there with uh, three gas, one electric. And that oven is also fan force as well too. All the standard stuff, so black stone sink with a, uh, a mixer tap with a water filter as well too. This particular customer has decided to go with the Xenolite splashback, which always looks very, very nice. Going all the way there to the ceiling at the end there. Coming through, so you've got a floor to ceiling pantry with three uh, uh, two, three slide out drawers with two 200 mil baskets uh, in each. So plenty of room in the pantry there. Coming through into the ensuite now, as you can see, it's a really wide mid ensuite, probably one of the widest, widest that you'll see on the market. Um, the reason for the wider ensuite is one, so we can offer this van without doing a flat floor, so it doesn't sit up too high, but also so we can fit a nice big front loading washing machine underneath that vanity unit there, which works really, really well. Now also too, um, not only do you have uh, a mirror, but you've also got a medicine cabinet that goes there behind that mirror there. Standard uh, Thetford China Bowl toilet with a couple of uh, towel rails there. Across the other side, we have got a stack of doors, so it makes it really easy to assist young kids inside the shower there, having that stack of doors. It's nice and neat out the way. Um, and you've got your one piece molded shower. On this side of the mid on suite, you've also got a linen press. So I showed you from the outside before, you've got your storage. Well, this is your internal storage now. So you've got two of these, one at the bottom and one at the top there. So you can put all your towels and what have you in there. Works really, really well. The other thing on this particular model, we've been able to put a cavity sliding door. So with the cavity sliding door, you can there give yourself some privacy when you're in the bathroom there. So you can just lock that off from the main area and you can even do the same from this bedroom area here. So you can lock that off. So in the mid on suite, two sliding doors to form its own complete room here. Moving across into the master bedroom now. So it's an island bed with storage underneath. So that just lifts up there. It's a slatted bed base, as you can see there, and plenty of storage. This is that area that I mentioned earlier, the customers put in a, a fridge drawer, so you can see there. So you lose a little bit just to walk around the bed, but we've covered that with the lino, so it actually blends in quite nicely um, and works quite well. So you have a little step up on that side and just your standard walk around on this side. All your other standard features there with your overhead cupboards, you've got um, a hanging space inside. You can uh, opt for shelves if you wish. Um, and then you've just got your standard drawer each side of the bed there. A couple of charging points with both USB uh, A and C. That's also houses your remote for your uh, inverter in here. Now, the other thing I forgot to mention, not only have we got Sirocco fans in uh, each side of the bed um, and also in the bunks, which I'll show you in a sec, this customer has decided to go with the Maxi fan. So this is the Maxi fan with the remote um, and it allows you to set a temperature, whack it on auto and it pretty much will uh, 
keep you at a temperature there that you desire. And that all runs off 12 volts. So um, really handy for these mid on suite uh, vans where the air con um, uh, needs to travel a long distance. It'll, it'll help uh, keep that bedroom nice and cool. The other thing, magazine pocket, and you've also got a TV point uh, in here as well too. So you can watch TV from this zone. Walking back through into the main zone here, you've also got another TV point for the main area that uh, you can watch from the lounge or from the kids' bed area. So this is the, the bunks that I talked about right at the back of the van there. So this particular customer has gone with the three bunk option, but uh, you can go with a two bunk uh, if you wish and have storage, have it like a tunnel boot going all the way through it at the back if you wish. Um, they've gone with the three-way fridge. So this is the, the Dometic three-way, 182 litre. So it'll run on gas, electric, and 12 volt for when you're driving. Um, they've also optioned in not only Sirocco fans for each of the bunks there, but they've put some bunk curtains in there just for a bit of privacy. Uh, so you can put the kids to bed and not be distracted by lights inside. And this is the kids' wardrobe. So they've got three shelves at the back, and then you've also got drawers underneath as well too. So I think you will uh, agree that we really have covered all bases in this particular van. This is the ultimate family van for going on long trips where you, you're wanting to have a little bit of space and privacy, having the three zones. Um, I think this particular family van here is the the absolute ultimate so if you like what you see please uh, head to our website and send through an inquiry on this van and we look forward to seeing you again soon